Good morning, friends. Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live. And uh, just quickly wanted to let you guys know what I'll be working on. Um, and right now, I want to try to get back to the issue to give you some updates on Planet X. Uh, very interesting things that have, that have been shared with me in relation to this. Some of those I'll just quickly, briefly tell you about. Um, of course, there's three different... Uh, celestial bodies that are being tracked. Uh, all of those are called comets by the uh, official narrative that I'm given, but all of them, with the exception of the first one, the next two, uh, 20, 2024, late 2024, early 2025, is uh, considered a, uh, a comet that can only be tracked using, um, uh, using the technology that is uh, uh, frequency-based. And, and that's because of the way this thing is made. The third one, which is the one that the government believes will be a uh, extinction level event, is will be visible, they say, in 2029, but late 2030, early 2031 is when it will do its damage. That being said, one of the things that I want to get into is the fact that there are reptilian entities that work with the military. And they have been talking about um, their cousins returning. Uh, so I'll be getting into that. I'll also be getting in a little bit of the Mayan document. Uh, not, excuse me, not the Mayan document, but the Kenya document that also speaks about the return of Planet X. So I'm hoping to put all this together for you later this evening and share that information with you. Uh, those of you that know that follow our Patreon channel, I did this one video the other day. YouTube within 10 minutes had it taken down, gave me a strike, and yet I did not violate any of the policy that they claimed that I had violated. Hadn't even discussed their mandates. I was only discussing um, a particular company and how it was created and who were the benefactors of that company. Yeah, so isn't that interesting? They just uh, arbitrarily decide how they're going to take who and who down and why and for whatever reason and doesn't matter if you protest it or not it's the way it is so we have to be very cautious in how we do these things uh, it was put up over on iConnect where it will not be taken down so you'll be able to see it there and um, uh, I did reload it to Patreon using iConnect so you'll still be able to see it there but I do have several other videos that I need to be putting together so Hopefully you'll be able to see those very soon. And, um, and thank you for your kindness, the support. Uh, we, just, we just got back home and I've been going through mail and also writing letters to sending out for, to send out to people that are, that, uh, for their kindness uh, that they show to us. God bless you. Uh, our website, IsraeliNewsLive.org. And, uh, and also I'm hoping to get into, thinking about doing some... Uh, Actually, my wife encouraged me to do this, do some short devotional teachings. That's not a, really, that is a very good idea because um, a lot of people are anxious about the things that are coming. I'm Steve Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. Thank you.